Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I have a regular journaling video for you. No frills, no weird stuff, no coffee making even. <laughs> I think I do pour some coffee in this. That's about it. Um, I've been using my V60 with the Hario um, like decanter thingy. Um, and then putting it on a tea light or what we call a tea light, which is basically just a thing with a candle in it. Uh, which keeps the coffee warm. Very nice. Um, other news, there isn't that much news. I've been settling in here quite well. Um, it's kind of nice being back here, especially since I'm going to be moving out of the country and um, having some time to spend with my family is actually quite good, quite nice. Um, tattoo is healing well. Um, it's in the peeling phase, which sounds kind of gross, but it just is the way it is. Um, when it's like done doing that, I can put a picture down below. It's I really love it. It's a beta fish tattoo. Um, did hurt when I got it. <laughs> like the foot is not like the the best place to get a first tattoo, I think. Um, but yeah, um, it's going fine. I hate that I can't wear shoes. Like they're like, please don't wear shoes the first two weeks. Not wearing shoes means I'm not running. Um, I'm doing other workouts, but. I miss running. So that's going on. Oh, <laughs> James got a dog. Um, I don't know, I might be able to show you a picture. It's a, uh, it was a dog from the shelter and um, he wasn't planning on getting a dog immediately, but he fell in love with his dog. Um, I hope you, yeah, it's not gonna be great, but there it is. It's some sort of retriever Labrador mix, I think. We think it's a duck tooling retriever mixed with a Labrador retriever. Uh, his name is Fitz. If you're all Robin Hobb fans, you know where that comes from. It's a year, he's a year and three months and um, he was surrendered to the shelter. So I think he was a pandemic dog. Um, uh, he is, he's very energetic, but like, he can he can sit. He doesn't pee in the house. He's like he's potty trained. Like I don't know why they surrendered him, but like you never know. Anyway, that's an update. Journal wise, um, so I shot this journaling section earlier in the week because today I am actually busy. Um, but I didn't do a journal video last week, so I wanted to do one. Now, I was still in the Carmine's Journal Journal, the Tomoe River one. I think I had it here, reaching, reaching. But, here, um, but I switched. I don't know if you've noticed, like ever since I started this journal, I haven't been writing as much. I could not find my way in it, even though the notebook is great. Like it's Tomoe River, um, it's hardcover. It's not the problem. I just couldn't find my groove with this journal. So I left it at, I don't know if this is gonna focus, probably not, this much. However, in the back, I always do my writing samples. Um, so this is like how much is left. It's definitely not gonna focus. And I'll use this for writing samples still. So it's gonna be used, but not as a journal. If you couldn't find my groove, it's fine, it sometimes happens. Um, as a precursor to my next journal video, I, I'll show you what I'm writing it now. <laughs> I put a sticker on this journal. It says, Apple hat stays on during sex. Um, it's very random. It's by Sugar and Sloth, love that. Uh, it's an Apica notebook, Apica Premium, Apica CD Premium. It's very coated paper. I don't know why I'm doing it, <laughs> but it's very coated. Um, so I found that I don't hate it. Um, I like it when I use broad nibs. I don't like it when you use fine nibs. So I guess I'm gonna stick to the broader nibs. Like I used a fine nib here, wasn't great. But then I went to broad nib and I like it. So it's an adventure. Constantly in the Galen folio. That is just my thing, my jam. Anyway, let us finally get onto the writing. I thought I didn't have anything to tell you, but I did. Let's go.